1994, The Little Rascals hit theaters, but wasn't a huge box office hit. Instead, it became a favorite among millennials due to frequent airings on cable TV. It's a sweet, low-key outing, but it's a standout because of its cast of delightful child actors. So, where is the cast of The Little Rascals now? Okay! Travis Tedford Previously seen as a tiny pitchman for Welch's grape juice, Travis Tedford played Spanky, leader of the Little Rascals. After appearing in forgettable movies like The 13th Floor, Tedford moved back to his home state of Texas in 2002, and now works in marketing for a large credit union. Brandon Bughall The actor who played the lovelorn Alfalfa followed up the Little Rascals with appearances in films like the aptly titled The Stupids, and played Eddie Munster in the Munster's Scary Little Christmas. Bughall has continued to work steadily, appearing on Castle, CSI Miami, and Criminal Minds. In the 2014 direct-to-DVD The Little Rascals Save the Day, he has a cameo as an ice cream man. Ross Bagley Of all his co-stars, Ross Bagley, who played Buckwheat, enjoyed the most high-profile acting career. Back when sitcoms brought in cute tykes to boost ratings, Bagley appeared as Nicky, the precocious little kid in The Fresh Prince of Bel-Air. He co-starred with Will Smith once more at Independence Day. Bagley later took a break from acting and recently earned his degree in film studies. Brittany Ashton Holmes Darla charmed audiences as the object of Alfalfa's affections, as well as the target of the He-Man Woman Haters Club. It was Brittany Ashton Holmes' first ever role, and has remained her most prominent. She retired from the screen at the ripe old age of seven, and is pursuing a degree in political science. Blake McIver Ewing Waldo was the villain of the Little Rascals, as the son of a wealthy oil baron played by Donald Trump. Post Little Rascals, Blake McIver Ewing voiced Eugene on Hey Arnold, and hosts The People's Couch. He's also worked with the It Gets Better project, and funded the recording of an album by working as a go-go dancer. Ewing opted to keep Waldo's amazing hair into adulthood, which is simply awesome. Kevin Jamal Woods The kid who played Stymie continued acting sporadically throughout childhood, appearing in two distinctly 90s things. He voiced a puppy in Babe, and guest starred on Walker, Texas Ranger. These days, Kevin Jamal Woods is an audio engineer and music producer in Texas. Zachary Mapri Porky stole a lot of scenes as Spanky's little brother and devoted assistant. It's the only acting Zachary Mabry ever did. Now, he's a public sector accountant in the Dallas area. Sam Saletta If there are a bunch of kids getting into crazy adventures, you need a bully to bug him, right? That's Movie Logic 101. Since playing Butch in The Little Rascals, Sam Saletta has done a lot of voiceover work, particularly for Recess, Rocket Power, and the video game Call of Duty Black Ops. He's also a singer-songwriter and played in a band called Jubala. Petey the Dog Petey's last on-screen credit comes from a 2012 documentary series called American Dog. And considering that The Little Rascals was released more than 20 years ago, it's safe to say Petey has since been uh, sent to a nice farm upstate where he can run and play all day. <laughs> Thanks for watching. Subscribe to our YouTube channel to watch more videos like the one you just saw, and leave us a comment to let us know which rascal was your favorite.